My car is fucked. Am I going to go and spend... I was thinking, yeah, let me get a little Audi or something for like five grand and that. And then I think to myself, nah. Nah, what, what, what am I doing that for? Nah, fuck it, man, because my car's fucked. It's probably going to fail the MOT. The window don't even go, go up and that. Um, I'm thinking, if I spend five grand, yeah, then I go down from this to this. That's five grand less I've got to spend on a new property in that. So fuck it. I'll just go and buy some cheap little car for a thousand pounds and knock around in that. I don't care. Guys, let me tell you something right now, yeah? You guys that think you need a nice car to bang girls, you are deluding yourself. I met a, I met a guy at one of my cousin's little functions, yeah? Me and him been bumping into each other when, I, my, when my cousin has these little functions and that. And I noticed he had a Mercedes. It's a nice one. It was like a, a, a C300. Nice. I was like, yeah, bad man car. That. I'd love to be driving that. Boom, gunmetal grey, innit, yeah? Um, yeah, sort of like this colour. You can see, it's gunmetal grey in it, boom. And I'm thinking to myself, unfortunately, because of the way this guy is as a person, it doesn't matter what car he drives, the girls are still not going to be attracted to him. Blood, I'm telling you right now, I've banged girls and they've never seen my car. Not because I've needed to hide it, but I've met girls and they said, yeah, you can come over and that. They didn't need to check my car. They didn't need to check how much money I've got. They don't know whether I've got properties and that. And I'm still able to bang them because it's you as a person that's going to get the girl. How many girls do you know right now that are pining over some waste, man? I, I, I've met girl, nice girl and that, that are still pining over some fucking ex. That's a waste, man. He does nothing. He does nothing. This is how you know you don't need money to get girls, blood. There's chicks right now who are in love with some guy that's in jail. Not a guy that they was with previously that's gone to jail. No. They met him through some like sort of pen pal thing or whatever, in it, yeah? And these girls are staying fucking loyal to a guy that's got two years left on his sentence. It, you, what can you do for a girl if you're in prison? You don't need money to get girl. Now, a man should be striving to get money for the benefit of their children and that, yeah, to help your offspring. But I'm telling you right now, you do not need no money to get a gal, yeah? Throughout the history of the world, most men that get, most of the men that get all the gal and that, they have no money, I'm telling you. You think, yeah, you need to be some basketball player or some high-flying stockbroker and that, forget it. You don't need that to get gal. You don't. You don't. Uh, uh, my girl, she was, she was saying that, um, one of her friends and that was dating one guy who she said out of her mouth, I didn't hear her say this, but I quote, the girl was like, oh, he's a bit of a waste man and that. And she broke up with him. Not because he was a waste man and he smokes weed and he don't make money like that. No, she broke up with him because he didn't want to commit to her. She was begging him and pining for him to commit to her. And he didn't. So she didn't break up with him, not because, oh, he's a waste man. He ain't going to be nothing in life. No, she broke up with him because she couldn't see a future with him because he didn't want to commit. She was willing, I guarantee you, if he said, all right, cool, let's get together, innit? Yeah? She would have taken him on as a broke guy. The girl has her own house. She could have, he could have moved into her house. She would have been happy with that. Now, maybe later on in life, the finances and that would have mattered. But they've been checking each other for like a year or so or whatever, innit? Yeah? So finance is well on top of her head. She has her own money and that. She didn't need any provision and providing for him. She just needs that. <clears throat> yeah, you understand what I'm trying to say? She didn't want to break up with him because he was broke. She wanted to, she broke up with him because she, he didn't want to commit. Girls are willing to be with a guy they even consider out of their mouth he's a bit of a waste, man. Because it's about who you are as a person, how you make that girl feel. So you don't need money, yeah? I'm, I'm still saying, man, forget money. I enjoy getting money. But I've realised getting money does not increase your, 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 your lay count, increase the girls that, that um, you think. Just get, getting money, what that means is, oh, now you get to be a member of this club and this club, yeah, quote, unquote, this club has higher quality of women. Because unless you have your money up, there's certain girls you ain't going to be able to get for the most part. There's some girls you're not going to be able to get. Because why is she going to want to date you when all the last guys that she's dated have Ferraris and millionaires and that, and you're just rolling up with your fucking Toyota and that? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. But most average girls, you can get them being broke and having no money. There's certain girls, you need to earn certain money just so you can put your foot in the door to get into that sort of club. But um, carry on with the video.